So this is what my Instagram icon looks like. In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize the Instagram icon. It's very simple. Hello and welcome to Malk Stiv. Just like the title says, we are going to change the Instagram icon. Now I went ahead and designed a couple of icons in Adobe Illustrator. So we're going to use one of the icons to customize our Instagram application icon on iOS. Now, if you like these designs that I've created and you'd want to use them, let me know down in the comments and then I can send you a link where you can download these designs. So let me show you how to customize the Instagram icon. So before we begin, please take the time to subscribe to my channel, like my videos, share them with anyone. I would really appreciate that. So in order to change the icon of your Instagram application, you need to make sure you're running iOS 14. If you're not running iOS 14, you won't be able to do this. So all we need to do, go to your home screen and tap on shortcuts. If you can't find shortcuts, you can quickly drag on your home screen, drag down and then type shortcuts. And once that opens up, tap the plus sign. So we're going to tap on that. Now it's going to ask us to create a new shortcut. So what you do here is tap on action. And when you tap on action, make sure you tap on scripting. Don't touch anything else. Don't touch anywhere else. Tap on scripting. Now, when you get to this screen, tap on open app right here. So this is going to open up a new uh, option and we have something that says scripting, open, choose. So if you tap on choose, it's going to list a bring of applications installed on your phone. Now, in this case, we want to change the icon for Instagram. So if you have so many applications, you can type here Instagram and Instagram will show up. If you don't have so many applications, it's easy. Just scroll down until you find Instagram. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on Instagram and Instagram is selected now. So the next thing here to do is tap on three dots. Now, this is where you change the icon name. So now that we've you know selected the name, we're just going to go ahead and hit done. Okay, so now that you've typed in the name, go ahead and add to home screen. And it's going to bring up this. And so you, you see where it says preview and then down here it says home screen, name and icon. Now we've already decided which name we want to use. So go ahead and change the icon. So I'm going to tap on icon. Now you can take a photo that you can use to replace the official icon used by Instagram. You can choose a photo or you can choose a file. Now in this case, I'm not going to take a photo. I already have an image saved on in my photos. So this is where it gets a little bit interesting because you have to download um, these photos that you want to use as icons. You can create something custom and then I'll select my logo and kind of adjust it in a way that you see this square box right here. Make sure that it fits in that area. And then I'll select choose. And then now I have my icon changed. So I'll select add. And so now this is added onto the home screen. So we'll hit done, done, and then go back to the home screen. Now, when you go back to the home screen, you can see that there's a new uh, shortcut being placed. So what you need to do here is go to the real application. For example, we'll go to Instagram right here. So, so press and hold Instagram and it's going to bring up this menu. What we want to do is tap on remove app. So if you tap on remove app, make sure you don't, make sure you don't press delete, please. Um, because that will delete the application. That's not what we want. So what you're going to do is tap move to app library. So if you tap on that, the application is going to be moved to the app library. Now, if we go back here, you can see that our social app is still there. So if you tap on that, it is going to open up Instagram. 
and that's how you change the app icon. Now you can do the same thing for any other applications that you want to change and customize. Check out my other videos on customizing iOS settings, iOS privacy settings. And as always, don't forget to stay awesome and I will catch you in the next one.